All right, Browns owners Dia Jimmy Haslam saying today at training camp they've reached a five-year extension with Chief Strategy Officer Paul D. Podesta to align his contract with the team's head coach and GM. A trio the Haslams, the Haslams, excuse me, would like to keep together for a while. So far, so good for D. and Jimmy Haslam's brain trust, who they say have exceeded expectations. I'd say better. Yeah. I'd say better. Yeah, more so. The combination of Kevin Stefanski, Andrew Barry, and Paul D. Podesta has fast-tracked the Browns from NFL bottom dweller to top ten favorite. The job they did last year, and just that had to be the hardest year for anybody to lead a pro sports organization, told us a lot. I mean, we felt good from the get-go, but working through that like they did and seeing them work together and not panic when things happen and just, you know, keep grinding, keep concentrating, keep building the roster, keep getting better, uh, we came out really feeling well. And the talent on the Browns roster has only gotten better. Yeah, it's fun. Um, I was talking to one of our senior talent evaluators and I always ask, you know, what do you think, what are you worried about, what do you like, what you don't like, and um, he said, you know, it's clear that, you know, we have talent on the field, but now that has to motive to, to move into wins. A major contributor to wins, of course, is health, especially with COVID-19 and its roster impacts still looming, which is why the Browns owners are happy they've crossed the NFL's vaccination threshold. I think the NFL and the organization have both done a really good job about talking about safety and health and safety. I mean, that's that's what we preach every day in the NFL, and I think it paid off over a period of time, and I think we're at 90 plus percent with the players, 100 percent with the staff, so I think it's education of the importance of taking the vaccine. And with that vaccination threshold met, the Browns can now focus on that other big goal. What would constitute a successful season this year? Dude, that's your question. Winning. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 